Hello and welcome to Memory Lane. Today we will look back at the 1978 American television series Dallas. We will revisit the cast of the series and see how they changed over the years. I will also tell you some interesting or funny trivial facts you probably did not know. Larry Hagman died at the age of 81 years in 2012 from myelodysplastic syndrome due to throat cancer treatments. Ken Kerchival died at the age of 84 years in 2019 from undisclosed causes. Patrick Duffy was 29 years in 1978 and is 73 years old in 2022. Linda Gray was 37 years in 1978 and is 82 years old in 2022. When Steve Connolly was talking about leaving the show due to his character's lack of development, it was Larry Hagman who came up with the idea to make Ray Krebs the illegitimate son of Jock Ewing in order to get Connolly to stay. Barbara Bell Geddes died at the age of 83 years in 2005 from lung cancer. Steve Connolly was 32 years in 1978 and is 76 years old in 2022. Howard Keel died at the age of 86 years in 2004 from colon cancer. Victoria Principal was 28 years in 1978 and is 72 years old in 2022. Larry Hagman, Patrick Duffy, Ken Kerchival, Linda Gray and Steve Connolly are the only actors to appear in both the first and last episodes of the series, Dallas, Digger's Daughter and Dallas, Conundrum. Charlene Tilton was 19 years in 1978 and is 63 years old in 2022. Susan Howard was 35 years in 1978 and is 78 years old in 2022. Deborah Renard was 21 years in 1978 and is 63 years old in 2022. Cheryl Lynn Rettino died at the age of 39 years in 1995 from breast cancer. Howard Keel refused to do a script reading for this show's producers at his first meeting with them, saying he was a lousy reader and that what they saw was what they got. Omri Katz was 7 years in 1978 and is 46 years old in 2022. Priscilla Presley was 38 years in 1978 and is 77 years old in 2022. Deborah Trinelli was 25 years in 1978 and is 67 years old in 2022. Sherry J. Wilson was 27 years in 1978 and is 63 years old in 2022. The spin-off Knott's Landing was created first, but the producers were unable to sell it. They developed this show instead, and when that became a success, and the network asked for a spin-off, they were able to dust off the Knott's Landing idea. Rosanna Christensen was 31 years in 1978 and is 71 years old in 2022. Joshua Harris was 6 years in 1978 and is 43 years old in 2022. Audrey Landers was 24 years in 1978 and is 66 years old in 2022. Jim Davis died at the age of 72 years in 1981 from multiple myeloma. Larry Hagman was the only actor to appear in all 357 episodes of the series. Kathy Poduel was 24 years in 1978 and is 58 years old in 2022. Jenna Lee Harrison was 26 years in 1978 and is 64 years old in 2022. Deborah Shelton was 35 years in 1978 and is 73 years old in 2022. 
Morgan Woodward died at the age of 93 years in 2019 from cancer. When Barbara Bel Geddes first left the show in 1984, Larry Hagman suggested that his real-life mother, Mary Martin play Miss Ellie. Kimberly Foster was 25 years in 1978 and is 61 years old in 2022. In May 1981, Delta Burke landed the role of Catherine Wentworth, but she was forced to turn down the part because she was contractually obligated to Filthy Rich, which was a spoof of this show.